Max, how much of a distraction will Kerr's health be on the finals? Uh, look, I do think that athletes can be distracted. When I was a kid, I used to think, oh, I'd read it in the papers, hear someone talking about it, and I'd be like, oh, come on, distracted, give me a break. The other guy was better, that's why you lost. The other team was better, that's why you lost. And then I've seen it now up close, up oh, that team where that player looks distracted, and in, occasionally, not all the time, but occasionally they do worse. I do yeah. not believe this is one of those cases because Steve Kerr is a value add if he's coaching, and obviously you'd rather have him, but I don't think yeah. the team is no, distracted I mean, if he's not. As you know, I don't believe in the idea of distractions. These guys are human beings that have real lives, that have real things going on in their lives. The idea of a player being there or a person being there or somebody getting arrested or something as a distraction, it's, some, it's a farce that was constructed by control freak football coaches because they didn't know what else to say. They want to blame something for their failures. The players can focus when they need to. Steve Kerr being there or not is a problem because of his ability as a coach, but it's not a problem you're arguing that somehow people are going to be thinking about, where's Steve? I can't shoot anymore? It's nonsense. Yeah, right. Might just be I'm actually, open. Get me the ball. I can't get you the ball. Coaching. I'm too distracted by Steve Kerr's absence. <laughs>